Well, we saw those wintry-like conditions yesterday. We saw our temperatures stuck in the 30s and even saw a few mix of those rain and snow showers. Just didn't see anything in the way of accumulation. Though still noticing snow showers as we start the morning, mainly for New York and Pennsylvania. But noticing a few flurries and lake effect snow showers trying to move on through. But nothing that has caused accumulation. Just the light dusting on parked cars. But that's really going to be it for our day today. And really, what I'm keeping my eye on, though, is this high pressure that's starting to build across the plains. It's going to really start to push all this clouds, rain and snow activity out of the area. So as we finish up the week, good chance we'll see the return of plenty of sunshine. Might notice a stray pocket today. But really, the bulk of it is going to come tomorrow, especially during the afternoon and for a feel-good Friday. But by Saturday, unfortunately, likely we'll see those clouds roll back in. But we're also going to see our temperatures warming up as well. So still a little bit colder today, just about average tomorrow. Good chance we're getting to the 50s for the weekend, even flirting with the 60s by the time we get to Saturday. We just don't stay warm as we see a next system come through Saturday into Sunday. We'll see our temperatures drop throughout the day Sunday before back into the 40s with another chance for some lake effect snow showers to start off early next week. But as we start the morning, currently 34 here in Wheeling with our cool spots of 32 up into Chester, Carrollton as well as down at the Woodsfield and New Martinsville, but as warm as 36 into St. Mary's. So still likely want to grab that coat as you step out the door this morning, since there's still a chance we could cool down just another degree or two. But really, much actually all the day going to be stuck in the 30s before we try to max out somewhere in the upper 30s, likely between 36 and 39 later this afternoon. This morning, though, still noticing a few of those lake effects, snow showers. Most of the area staying dry, just might notice roads a bit damp and a few flurries here and there through the morning. We'll see a couple areas towards I-77 try to see a few pockets of sunshine. So it's actually a better chance you see a stray pocket of sunshine than you even do the snow showers through the afternoon. A few more try to move on through, especially for Harrison, Jefferson, and Bro Hancock and Brook County. Most of us, though, won't see the snow showers today, but could notice a little bit of activity. Try to roll in overnight tonight. So once again, most of us don't see anything. And even if you do see, just know that roads are still temperatures just at and above, but Carrollton through New Philadelphia, Mill Millersburg, a little bit cooler. But anything that has been falling snow far, well, falling so far has been melting and likely will continue to melt on impact throughout the day today. But tomorrow, early in the morning, 6 a.m., could see another round of snow showers try to move on through. Most of us don't see it, but what everyone does see, the sky is clearing throughout the day. So by 5, 6 p.m. should be pretty much clear skies and we'll likely see that stay through our feel good Friday. So expect temperatures to warm back up into the mid to upper 50s with plenty of sunshine throughout the day. Then 60 straight shower Saturday evening with likely rain and dropping temperatures throughout the day on Sunday. That changes into snow showers late Sunday into early Monday morning. So can't rule out a stray snow shower in the morning. Temperatures in the 40s then cleaner skies throughout the day. So 44 and mostly sunny for a day on Tuesday.